What's up, guys? It's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome, welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. That's right, we're in episode two of the newest season. That's right, Primal Fear with Ark Bionic. I think we're going to be calling this bionic fear yeah bionic fear i love it i love it it should be pretty cool but guys thanks for coming hanging out in episode two make sure to show that amazing support by slamming that thumbs up button and if you're not yet do not forget subscribe for the new season want to be first to watch it for sure anyway last episode we got pretty far. We did pretty good. We got up to metal tools. We got most all the, the main starter uh, tables crafted, including the primal fear smithy. So pretty cool. We got our crop plots set up um, so that today we can start to work on them. Yeah, start to uh, move on with the kibble. We got a bunch of new tames um, or tames from last episode. Two pteranodons. Yep. We got this little Lystro and two Dodos. These guys are mostly right now for poop so that we can get our fertilizer. Ooh, and get those eggs. Eggs are very, very important because if we want to move off of taming anything else other than vanilla in Primal Fear, you got to make all the kibbles, which it's kind of a pain in the butt, but we'll get there. So the next stage after the normal kibbles is toxic kibble so for that we need to get to rock carrots today at least after that we're going to need citronol and so forth so on we're going to focus on this today so rock carrots it's kind of difficult to get the seeds we do have some i do have long grass seed anything else and savert seed but we got to get the rock carrot seed so i think a trike or something along those lines would be super helpful and then for the egg and poop farm if we can get ourselves uh, the, what is it? The soul thing, the dino soul. Yeah, this, the soul terminal. If we can get this today, this will make our lives so much easier. So we need for this cementing paste, not a big deal. Um, oil and polymer is what we don't have yet. For whatever reason, I thought it was obsidian I needed, but oil and polymer. All right, let's go hop on our pteranodon instead of just sitting there. I could be picking poops up all day long. Let's go find some of that stuff. So, if we could find a mantis or a carcanos that are vanilla, we might... I, I think a mantis would be more speed. Or, if we find some penguins, which we could potentially find some penguins off in the winter biome. Now, it's a little scary early on right now, because we don't have teleporting yet. And, uh, as you remember in primal fear, if we run into like a celestial or something like that, we're toast. We are absolutely toast. So we got to be super duper careful. Usually the deserts are pretty bad in primal fear, but I don't know. I feel like it would be worth it. If we could find a mantis, um, you know, we'll be pretty much set. So yeah, it's going to take me a hot second to fly there. I'll see you guys right back. All right, guys, I've arrived to the desert. Um, I figured I probably should cut in record in case this is our demise, which it very easily could be. This is very risky for us to go over here because I have no idea what to expect. We very likely could see some really bad things or who knows? Maybe we see nothing bad. All right. I'm seeing a crud ton of turtles, pteranodons and dodos, a couple of brachios. So, so far, not, not too bad. A couple of scorpions, not that big of a deal. Man, I got to stop for stamina like every two seconds on this guy. Come on, buddy bros. I do not see any mantis yet. So we're going to have to hope. We're going to have to hope that they're around here. Um, carrying on through. Oh, wait, is that a mantis? Did I just see one? Please tell me I did. Please, please. Yes. All right, um, are those normal alpha mantis crap and a normal mantis? I don't know. Like, I really don't know if I can take this or not. We're spinning for 2,500. That's pretty respectable early on. All right, all right. We got to make sure that other mantis doesn't harvest it. Get away, get away. Oh my goodness. All right, please tell me what I get, what I get. Nice! All right, that is everything we need for now. We're going to get the crap out of here. 
I don't know. Maybe I could take him on. I, I really don't know, but it's kind of scary. So since we have what we need and weight wise, we're, we're pretty weighed down right now. Let's go head back to the base. All right. We made it back safely. So that's cool. We still need to get the oil, though, before we can craft this. So let's go drop off this stuff. Let's see if we can find a trilobite. That's probably going to be our best bet. Let's grab all those goodies. Nice. This is turning out all right. I, I have to say, it's turning out already better than I thought it would. Let's go throw all these in there. You're doing awesome, buddy, bro. Very, very awesome. So, uh, yeah, let me get let me get this stuff sorted. All right. We were able to get a ton of chitin, too, which is pretty cool because we should be able to use that to now make a water jar, which I might as well get crafted. Since we're going to head towards the water, something we always need. And then, uh, oh man, there's something else that I needed. Oh, oh, this is what else it was. We can upgrade our saddle, which is going to be huge. So yeah, lots more protection since we have plenty of keratin. Oh, we got lucky. That's the max you can do. Holy cow. Oh, man, I feel so lucky. You should, too, Mr. Tyranodon. Wowzers. All right, let's go ahead and fill up our water jar. Nice. And, yeah, let's head on out. Let's see if we can find... Oh, we got some level ups, too. All right, give myself a little bit more health. Do you have any? Nope, no level ups on our Tyranodon. All right, can we find a Trilobite? Um, we could also do it if we found one of those whale things. Or if we went... uh. All the way to Eldridge, but I think that would be a pretty bad idea. Definitely not a good one. Ooh, I see a whole bunch of trilobites just right there. Oh, yeah, Th this is where we're going to get it. This is where we're going to get it. I don't think we needed all that much oil. I think it was only like 10 or 20. All right, but let's head on in here. Yes, and there's like nothing bad around here. This is perfect. Stay away from me, dolphin. I heard you. Oh, man. Oh, man. Come on. Come on. These guys are tough. That's a 580. Ooh, ooh. I'm not hitting you, dolphin. Go away. I'm in. I'm in the middle of stuff, you turd. Oh, man. All right. Is this guy a smaller one? Oh, man. If I, You know what? If I push him up on shore... I can use my Pteranodon pro- oh, jeez! I can probably use my Pteranodon to get him. Alright, come on. Come on. Go up on shore. Let's go. Let's go. Alright, this guy's done. Now, I can't remember what's better to harvest him. If it's pickaxe or hatchet. Ooh! My goodness, a hundred? That's ridiculous. That's That's surely more than we need. Soul Terminal? Yeah, we only needed seven. All right, well, you know what? I think that's good enough. All right, coming back in for the landing. Beautiful. And let's go ahead. Let's craft this Soul Terminal. So, oh, uh, where is it? There we go. Boom. Boom. Oh, my goodness. This is going to be so good. All right, so we got our Soul Terminal. Um, I'll set it right here, I guess, for now. Awesome. All right. And we're going to want to change some of the settings on this guy. Uh, let's see here. How do we do that? Options, automation. All right. So we're going to want passive generation, miscellaneous poop generation, poop generation. And I think that's every. Oh, and fertilized egg collection. Boom. All right. Awesome. Now, most of these should be females. So that being said, so we got the one male. I think once they're in this, it, it ends up not really being helpful having like mate boost. Oh, I see an egg. I see an egg. Give me. All right. Let's go next one. Boom. And oh, okay. Well, that pteranodon's a female too. So we're going to get a slew of eggs now. So that is awesome. Eggs and poo. All right, so let's go ahead and throw all these guys in there. Awesome. And it should automatically, whenever we check in here, there's 300 slots. We should see eggs and we should see poo. 
So that is a pretty good thing. Doing all right? All right, I'm gonna make another Froggy Mac kibble station for now, because those actually work as a fridge also. So where is it? Where is it? How do I not see it here? I'm going blind. F M K and there we go. Yeah, there's almost nothing this thing don't do. It is awesome. And boom. All right, and let's just confirm that it works as a fridge. So let's go ahead, put the kibble station right there. And we got said egg on us. So it says 39, 23, 58. And look at it now. Holy crap. Quite the fridge. Definitely. All right. I'm digging it. I am totally digging it. Um, Next, we have to go hunt out a trike. So let me see if I can find one. And I guess we could make the trike. No, we'll make wait to make the saddle. We'll wait until we get back. All right, guys. I located a trike. Pretty decent level, too. No, that's not it. That's not it. There, there, 580. 580 trike. Awesome. All right, we're going to have to get rid of some of the baddies around the area first. All right, come on. Oh, man, there's a forest titan right there. Are you kidding me? Oh, this is going to be rough. All right, and is that the level? Let's get rid of this level 80 guy. Get out of here. All right. Oh, man, I'm kind of scared. I'm definitely kind of scared. Oh, but we can do it. I have faith. I have faith. Let's go ahead. Let me pick you up, buddy, bro. Oh, can we do this on foot? Our health's up pretty high now, so I do have a good feeling about it. I hope. I hope. Come on. Come on. Oh, yeah. This is doing major torpor to this guy. Go, 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 go. It is a 580, though. We do have to keep that in mind. Come on. I got to hit him not in his... Oh, in his face. Oh, crap. It's doing a bit more than I had expected. Come on. All right. Oh, I think I keep getting, like, face hits. You don't want to tr hit the trikes in their face. Come on. I'm trying to hit his, his feet. Crap. Come on. Yelp. Ooh. Why does it feel like it's doing way less torpor now? All right, all right, er, keep on going. We can do it. All right, he's starting to run. Perfect. Down for the count. All right, simple kibble. Quick, quick, quick. Uh, I don't know how many it said. What did it say? One. All right, I'll take it. I will take it. Give me. All right, let's get this guy balled up immediately. Holy crap, let's get the crap out of here. I'm so scared. There's, there's something over here that keeps on exploding. I just, I don't know. I am permanently permanently like scarred from all the shenanigans last time i played primal fear the the celestials just shooting you out of the sky oh that was crazy um i tried to land down around one of these islands and i started hearing these huge explosions no clue what it's from all right guys we are coming back in on the base and Oh, man, this is going to be so epic. So we should be able to get our seeds now. This will be huge. All right, golden, you good? You good. All right, let's go make a trike saddle. I think we do that in our inventory, actually. Tri oh, I didn't unlock it yet, did I? Trike. All right, trike saddle. Beautiful. All right, and once again, trike saddle. Awesome. All right, and pretty inexpensive. Let's go ahead and upgrade it once it's ready. Come on, bro. We can grind that up. Perfect. All right, let's get some upgrades in. Horrible upgrade. All right, all right, that was good. Boom. All right, not nearly as good as our Pteranodon, but that's okay. That is A-OK -okay with me. Let's hope there's no crazy dodos out here. All right, Mr. Trike. You... Go on down. We never put him to passive unfollow. Let's do that. Let's give him the saddle. Awesome. And let's go ham. Boom. All right, get those seeds, bro. All right, starting to get seeds. Start. Oh, yes. All right, we still need, I think, rock carrot seeds. I didn't notice them. Come on, give me those rock carrot citron all. I know you can get them, bro. I know you can. I... Faith in you. Did, did we get any? 
Uh, ooh. Okay, no, Citronol. Come on, dude, you can do it. All right, yep, get all happy. I just gave you some level ups. Come on, do you see him? I don't see him. We're gonna do it together, guys. We're gonna do it together. Come on, you dumb seeds. Um, Savru. Come on, long grass. Oh, I see him, I see him. All right, we're golden. We are a golden. All right, let's grab all the seeds out. Beautiful. You did your job, bro. You did your job. So, of course, we'll use them for harvesting more berries. I'll just grab all everything out. We got a feeding trough. All right, beautiful. So, what else do we need for our seed farm? So, let's go ahead, throw all the berries in uh, here. Bing, bang, boom. Let's go throw all the excess seeds in here. Boom. All right. So we need rock carrot and then we'll need citronol. Then we'll need long grass. And what's the final one? And savru. Perfect. All right. So the order in which we need these. Um, where is it? Uh, consumables, kibble. So in order to get the toxic kibble, that is the rock carrot. The alpha will be the citronol. So rock carrot and then citronol. All right. Fair enough. Let's go ahead and here. Let's throw the rock carrot. Awesome. Let's throw the citronol. Beautiful. We'll just do those two for now. How are we doing over here? Oh my goodness. Look at all that poo. Feces. Grab it all. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Start to get to our fertilizers. Let's go ahead and grab all these out. So I'm glad I got those started last episode all right toss all those in there and then we should have a few more in here doing great absolutely amazing all right perfect so we do have our plants on a uh, a faster speed here so they should grow pretty fast um that should be good so it is seeded we don't have any greenhouse effect yet um but we can work on that all right, and those in there too. So, how we doing? Seedling, not bad. Moving up in the world. All right, I'm going to give these guys a little bit of time. Um, Not sure if I'm going to even have to bother making a greenhouse. But it seems like they're growing pretty fast. So, I will see you guys right back. All right, guys, we are doing amazing. I think they're both already fruitlings. Yes, so good. So very good. I went through and I unlocked a whole bunch more Ingrams. So I got all the other kibbles and everything. Not all of them, but all the ones that come up next unlocked so that we could actually see what the other shenanigans would require. So the next kibble is the elemental kibble. That took the Savru and then the long grass for the apex. And then after that, it's just a mixture. So I set those guys up. So all we got to do is dump in. We have Savru and then the long grass. Um, come on. It's still taking a while to actually yield any fruit. But yeah, they're fruit links. Um, Next up, I kept on noticing no eggs were coming up. And I went and double checked the options. I actually had the automation wrong. By mistake, I clicked fertilized egg. We want unfertilized egg. So I fixed that. And yes, now we're actually... Getting eggs, so that is a good thing. Let's uh, let's get all these feces out. So feces. Let's grab all those again. So yeah, as you can see, it's just so much easier. So so much easier to get this farm going. All right, so that is very cool. Um, we're gonna get our trike out again. I need to get some more uh thatch. For sure, more thatch. Thatch needs to be a thing. Let's see, is it faster if I do it? I don't know. It's probably about the same. At least at this point. We haven't leveled up our trike yet. All right. Let's just get enough. Get like 10,000 thatch. I think should be more than good enough. All right. Beautiful. So we can get all the... Th oh, a little bit more thatch. All right. So we can get all of those uh, compost bins all full. Because it's going to be not too much of a hassle, but it will be a hassle to keep up. All right, so there we go. 5,000. 
you're filled up and you sir are not filled up all right we'll get a few more more poo all right doing good guys doing good so next up once this dang thing actually starts to make come on I was trying to unlock far enough to get the greenhouse stuff done, and apparently I didn't have enough Ingram, so we might have to level up for a little bit. I guess we'll get levels if I just uh, harvest with this guy for a while, so maybe I'll do that, but I'd, it would be super sweet if we can get an Alpha Pteranodon today, because that would actually give us speed, because we can't boost the speed on a vanilla one, and we do not have Noxious Dinos, so normally I'd go and get the Noxious Pteranodon next, but... Yeah, not a thing. It's going to be tougher for us this season, guys. Much tougher. All right, guys. While we're waiting for all of our uh, crops to finish, I'm going out leveling up. And we got to the point where I could unlock all of our, not all the pastes, but I could unlock at least the beginning paste. So I got myself some stuffed paste. Yeah, this is like having uh, food for me or for my dino. So that's pretty cool. I also got some of this stuff, which is Instatame paste. Um, it's called stuffed paste. Uh, no, not stuffed paste. We have famine paste. This will starve out the dino. And then I also got a grow up paste, which do you remember what this goes, guys? This will imprint our guy to 100% as if it was a baby. So that will actually help out our Pteranodon to be a, quite a bit stronger. We'll get better stats and yeah, it, it upped all of our stats. So that's pretty cool. And then also the XP potions. Yeah, so we're pretty good now. Definitely. This thorny dragon man. I've been going after him. But uh, his spike... Ooh, we got to be careful. His spikes do torpor. Oh, we have to be really careful. But hey, we're doing damage to him. And in this mod, uh, dinos don't get their health back like instantly. Which is pretty helpful, because I already did a number to this guy. But we should get mega XP. Yes! Oh, so good! Get wrecked, bro! And then we got a bag here, too. Let's see it's in the bag. Anything good? All right. Oh, look at that! That's not bad. We can dump out those. All right, golden! We got a slew of levels. Oh, no, froggy man! Poor guy! I don't even know if he's online right now. I'm, I'm not even sure. Um, what I am sure about is we might be in trouble this season. Because look what spawned up there. Yeah. Oh, it fell off the side. A demonic spawned up here. I've never seen such a thing. There's Froggy Man. You can see him running. Dude, that demonic's about to wreck him. I don't even know if I want to witness that. That is scary. Seriously scary. Holy cow. Good luck, Froggy Man. We'll be teaming up with him soon. But he's just today, I think, is his first day. So he's starting off. Starting off. All right. Um. Anyway, where were we? Our base is right over here. He's just right around the corner. All right. Hopefully by now. Hopefully, hopefully. Oh, crap. Do I just re... He better not pull that dragon over to us because I will cry like a little baby if we get everything destroyed. Holy. All right. All right. Um, I got to work on so many stats in this guy. It's not even funny. We need to upgrade like seriously. Do I have two? Okay. We have two. So that's enough. I believe with two. Let's go ahead and throw that in there that we should be able to make one toxic kibble. All right, let's go ahead, pull. All right, bottom boom. And I think one toxic kibble is enough to tame a toxic dodo. I believe we're, we're going to have to hope. We're going to have to hope. All right, all right. Let's go ahead, dump the rest of the stuff. We got to be really, really uh, good about all of our stuff. All right, so we got stuffed paste. We don't need food anymore. Let's get rid of this stuff. We got uh, dodos all around us. Ooh, look at that. Let's save those. Save all of those. All right. We good? I think we good. I think we're good. Let's throw that in there. All right. Beautiful. So let's see if we can tame a toxic dodo. Um, There's no toxic flyers in this mod currently. All right. So I've, there's a bunch of toxic dodos all around here that I've kind of just let chill. 
I know there's a zombie one around here. Might have it might have been pulled away. All right, so yep, look at female toxic dodo. Perfect, exactly what we want. Let's see if we can get this guy knocked out. All right, Mr. Pteranodon. Oh, this is gonna be scary. All right. I don't have too many. Oh man. All right, let's just hope. Let's just hope that it goes down quickly. Oh yeah, 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 look at that. Oh, that one might, yep, that was enough. Beautiful. Oh, I shouldn't have picked that up yet. I shouldn't have, that was not smart. Um. Oh, okay, and it went fast enough. Beautiful, all right, so we got a toxic dodo now. Um. Crap, crap, crap. That might not have been his egg, that's, that's the reason why, or if there's other toxic dodos in the area. Holy, all right, oh. So, if we bring this guy up and let him sit in our our little soul thing, then he should make a toxic egg and not too... Oh, we already got a toxic egg. So, I mean, that's good. Um, I might only need... Let's see, what do we need for the kibble? What do we need for the kibble? Um, consumables. Kibble. Alpha kibble. Dude, only one. Do we have all this stuff? I think we do. Ooh, and guess what? Because we had that food. All right, we can make an alpha kibble. Epic! All right. Oh, let's see. For an alpha pteranodon now. Oh my goodness, that would be so good. Let me see uh, if there's anything alpha that we can actually tame with just one kibble. Otherwise, we gotta wait for it to make uh, more toxic eggs. Which it will do in time. Anyway, I'll see you guys right back. Oh my goodness, we got a 580 Alpha Pteranodon. It's really close by the base, like really close by. Oh, this is going to be epic. All right, so I don't think I can ball of this guy. I don't remember, but since he's on the ground, we're going to try this first. This is super cheaty, but it just might work. It just might work. All right, all right. He's likely stuck underneath this right now. So, that being said, oh crap, is he, is he? All right, whatever, we're gonna hit him. All right, got him, got him, we gotta follow him. Crap, 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 pick up. Go, go, follow him. All right, Torpor's still rising on him. Is it, okay, it, it leveled off. All right, all right, he doesn't, see, he's not scared of us yet. All right, mate, I don't know, should I try and bowl him? I feel like I should. Oh man. This is going to be annoying. All right, come on, bro. Just land. Oh, this is going to be so good if we can get this guy. So incredibly good. All right, come on. Just land, bro. Just land. All right, all right. He's coming in maybe for a landing. Me. Oh. I'm kind of ticked off. I really thought that would work, putting the ruins on top of them. Because what will happen is dinos will get stuck underneath it. And then you can still shoot them through it. It's pretty cheaty. But hey, you know, you got to take advantage of anything that you can do. All right. Um, At this point, I don't know if he's going to go to land. And I'm still afraid to try and bola him. I guess we could try. Because if we can bola him, <gasps> if we can bola him... This is easy street. All right, did it work? Did it work? No, see? See? Didn't work. Maybe? Oh! All right. Didn't work. All right, we're going to have to do this the old-fashioned way. Oh, man, this is going to be tough. Oh, oh, oh! Yes! All right, that should be an easy shot. On Whoa, where are you going, bro? I hate that. All right, get a headshot. Oh, crap. Come on, bro! Yo! All right, we got another hit in. That's at least good. And I'm using right now the uh, the potent arrows, which actually we can make more of. Let's do that. Arrows, boom, potent. Those are the primal fear arrows, the first stage. All right, how we doing? It's halfway up, so maybe two more hits? Maybe? It's probably going to get scared and run, though, after this one. Oh, man. Dillos. Go away! No, don't you do me! All right, all right, there it is, there it is. Oh, this is so stressful. 
So very stressful. All right, all right. I have no idea what's around here either. Oh, crap. Crap, crap, crap. That's the next thing is that these guys might, uh, after I knock them out, we, like, we have to be careful where we do this. All right, all right. If I can get two hits in. Oh, crap. All right, missed. Get a headshot. You, Dude, that should have hit, and it didn't sh register. All right, all right. One. Two. Oh. All right, at this point, he's going to be scared of us. Um, I guess I could set the ruins on him as soon as we knock him out. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, crap. All right. Hit him. Should be knocked out, I think. Or it's going to be. It, this should do it. As soon as he lands, I got to set those ruins. This should get him. This should get him. Don't fall on top of something. Are you kidding me? <gasps> no! All right, he doesn't seem like he's scared of me, at least. So that's a positive. Um, and it doesn't seem like there's too much badness here. So that's a positive. All right, let's, uh... Wait. Oh, yes, 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 yes. This is it, guys. This is it. This is it. All right, all right. And... Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Come on. No. Yes. Boom. D did that not hit him? What is going on with these arrows? What the crap? There we go. All right, all right. Let's get this one kibble in him quickly. Come on, dude. Oh, I'm so stressed out. Oh, and we did it, guys. We did it. All right. We got our guy. Let's pack him up. The next question is, can we afford the saddle? All right. Done. Done. Holy, I cannot believe it. That everything worked out in our favor. Everything perfect. Could not get any better. Oh, and there's a toxic dodo right there, too. All right. Um, I'll meet you guys back at the base. All right, guys, we are back at the base, and yes, we have our alpha pteranodon. Okay, let's see about the saddle. So, Patera and alpha pteranodon saddle unlocked now. We need 460. 460 of the hide. Do we have that? That is a good question. 430. No! So we need 30 more before we can actually ride this guy. All right, all right. Um... We should be able to get that off of, like, dodos and and that type of shenanigans. Let's just see what else there is. All right, toxic dodo. Don't care about you. Come on, alpha. Oh, oh, there's an alpha. Now, I don't know what this enforcer is going to do. I don't know if they'll get mad at me. Come on. All right. Come on. Come this way. I have no idea what to expect with this enforcer. None. Got him. All right. And, oh, please tell me I harvested him. No, that little crappy copy stole it. Oh, wait, is this an alpha? Oh, my goodness. All right, we're golden, guys. That just gave us 500. What? That's a lot. That might be too much. I'm telling you, we got to play with the eye eyes. But anyway, doing good enough to make our saddle. Kind of lucky there. Hey, just finding a, a dead gator like that. All right, buddy, bro. Let's uh, let's unload all this stuff. Awesome. Got more arrows. Got more goodies. All right. Sweet. Good enough for me. Let's go ahead and make up that saddle. All right. So uh, saddle. Alpha pteranodon. Bada boom. Nice. Now, we don't have enough to upgrade it yet, but, you know, we will shortly. Now that we have this guy, we should lickety split. All right. Boom. Not a bad looking one either. Definitely not. Let's give it some meat. Let's give it the pickup thing. Very cool. Um, It is a male, but we can always swap the gender of it. So that's cool. And we can also do the grow up paste on it. But look at it. Oh, so much better. Such a bigger creature, too. Way bigger than a, a normal one. We should... It should ha Its spinner should have less of a cooldown. Let's see what it hits for off the bat. 
Wow, way stronger. That's pretty cool. Let's give it a couple of uh, these things. Bing, bang, boom. Way higher health too, higher weight, and we can boost that movement speed. That is a beautiful thing. Can we walk backwards with you? Hold on, we gotta, oop. Oh, let me get this guy. Get wrecked! Can I, yes, and I can walk backwards with him? It is just an improvement all the way around. And we're gonna get our first prime meats right here. Come here, bro. Get wrecked and our first prime mates, dude. That is so much. That is so much. All right, let's boost up movement speed. Gets really nice. It looks like three boosts per, which is always a good thing. All right, we're golden, guys. We are golden. Flying high in the sky with our Alpha Pteranodon. Seriously, cannot do much better than that. All right, well, at this point, I think we did pretty good today, guys. We got all the way to Alpha tier. Got our crops. It is, uh, it's a good day. It's a very good day. So, yeah, let me find where the crap our base is. Let me go through those comments. All right, guys, I just finished going through the comments, and yes, it is that time. That's right. Time to name the dinos! For those of you that do not know, at the end of every single episode, I go through the comments of the previous episode and I pick out all the most awesomest name suggestions that you guys leave in the down there. That's right. Just remember, if you want to have a chance at getting your name chosen, you got to be a subscriber. So smash that subscribe button if you got a comment down below. It is just that easy. Anyway, for today, we have our first Pteranodon to name. It's always special naming the first Pteranodon for sure. We did get other tames, but in all honesty, we're never going to see them for the rest of the season. They're going to stay in that soul thing just to make poop and eggs. That's it. So, you know what? I'm not going to even give them a name, just the guys that we're going to see. So, on that note, this Pteranodon will be named none other than... Tornado! I love it. Very cool name. Always an awesome name for a Pteranodon. For next episode, we got to come up with the name for Alpha Pteranodon, which, by the way, because it is a male, we're going to use the gender swap paste. Yeah! So now it's a female, and it can lay eggs, too, in our soul thing. Very cool. So we need a name for Alpha Pteranodon and for our trike, which, oh, crap, you're a male, too? You know what? We got plenty of uh, vanilla eggs, so that's fine. Anyway, yeah, very cool. I had so much fun today, guys. Seriously, so much fun. It's only going to get better from here. But guys, thank you so very much for watching. It's been a pleasure. As always, show that amazing support for the series by smashing that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, do not forget to subscribe for the ARC awesomeness. Also, to let you know, I am doing a Minecraft series right now, too. And what I'm going to be doing, well, this will always take priority from here on out. It's going to be rotated a day of this and then a day of Minecraft. Now, whenever I can, I will try and get an extra video out of this, but I don't want to stress myself out doing too much. So, yes, we're, we'll rotate it. But if there's ever going to be two in a row, it will be of this. So just to let you know. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. And as always, peace out.